you just do it, turn out okay. <clears throat> hey everybody, it's Day Night here, and even though I'm bright right now, my light behind me, or ahead of me, in front of me, I guess that wearing makeup, powder stuff like like the people do, so I won't glow like people do. Anyways, I'm here for, anyways, whatever. The glowing, my glowing personality aside, I'm here to, for my WrestleMania predictions. Coming up in a few hours. All right. I'm not gonna do any order. I'm gonna do order this list here. So, all right. The first on the list is Ronda versus Charlotte versus Becky. I, I'm guessing I want Becky to win. I think she's gonna win. All right. Next, Brock versus Seth. Little iffy. I'm gonna go for a face. I'm gonna go for it again. I think this is Brock's gonna finally be get me through the WrestleMania. This is gonna be Seth's 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 time. I'm going for Seth. Daniel next one WWE Championship. Daniel versus Kofi Kingston. Uh, I hate to say that. I think that I think. Kofi's gonna win. I think Kofi should win. It'll be like a uh, <laughs> they called it a redo of the WrestleMania 19. They did the same storyline, and I think having Kofi the belt even for a day or two would be, be cool. And then let me make, make another few dollars of this. <laughs> now here's the tricky one. Next one in the list is Roman Reigns versus Drew McIntyre. This is my, this might be the first. Time since WrestleMania 30, Roman Reigns isn't going to get automatically booed when he gets out, comes out of the ring, and you know he's a fan baby face now. I think to keep the goodwill, maybe they should have Drew McIntyre win this match to prove he is dominant. You know, Roman can always can Roman can always make a comeback later. You know. Because they're usually going to usually usually balance out these feuds one one win a piece, but I think for this first match of them, the new, I think Drew should continue with dominance, and maybe play in the leukemia storyline. And you know, some people will say they're going to have Roman win because of sympathy, but I think they take the sympathy. Maybe they should keep keep him, let him lose. Next one: AJ Giles versus Randy Orton. I think Styles is going to win this one. Okay, next is Triple H versus Batista. I think Triple H is going to win this one since his career is on the line. But you never know. This might be his last. He might be retiring. He's up in the 40s now, you know. I'm trying to wrestle till was fifty, but maybe this is, it might be the end. But I think Triple H is going to win. And the champion, champion champ Bobby Lashley versus Finn, Finn Balor. I think Finn Balor is going to win because he's the demon. But if he doesn't win, that's to be the first time the demons lost a fight. But I think this is time to push Finn Balor. Who knows? Maybe next year he'll be wrestling WrestleMania. Championship. United States Champion Samoa Joe versus Rey Mysterio. I think they're going to have Joe win, especially since Rey might be uh, has been injured, but he's been cleared apparently. So I still think Joe's going to win since he's the new kid in the block, and it's time to pass the torch. The women's tag team match, Shasta and Bailey versus Beth and Fe Beth and Talia versus the S Naya Naya and Tamina versus the Iconics. I think, I think it's a time between the Iconics maybe winning, put another victory, and and Sasha and Bailey keeping keeping their titles, but. Uh, I'm gonna have to go with Sasha and Bailey. 
was a constant close second. Miz versus Shane. I think you know Miz has Miz has a his record of losing at WrestleMania matches except for maybe last year he tagged with Daniel Bryan and when he beat his father his father in X Seven, but I think Shane might win this one due to interference and technical technicalities. You know, the possibility to have my, my, they might have Miz overcome it. I'm going for Shane this fight. Alright. Next one is Kurt Angle versus Baron Corbin, the farewell match. I think Kurt's going to win this one. Might be a squash, but might be a squash match. Maybe, I don't know. At the rumor, at least. And might be. I have another match right after that with some famous pro, real, real wrestler. Not, Kevin's real, not that Baron Corbin is real or not, but they say the last match of a wrestler's career should be on on his back. So and and let the new guy and let the new guy beat him. But I don't know if they're gonna do that with. Even though I'm not, I don't know if they're gonna do that with Kurt and have Kurt uh, uh, Baron squash Kurt or not. Maybe, I don't know, but I'm hoping Kurt wins, and it's a bigger story for later down the line. Alright, next up, this, the SmackDown Tag Team Championships, Usos versus Rick and Alistair versus The Bar versus Rick and Maria thing. I think this one's a tie between the Usos and Rick and Black. I think maybe... The Usos probably might get his, get his victory. And this might break up Ricochet and Black. I'm not sure. Like the, the single stars again. Or maybe they might win too. But I'm going for the Usos. Next, the Raw Tag Teams. The Rival versus Kurt Ryder and... The, the Rival versus Kurt Hawkins and Zack Ryder. I think the Rival's going to win. And this might... This is, will... Probably Mitch might break up Zach and Kurt again, and one of them might become a heel. As I do these things, Kurt might blame Zach for losing, and and Zach might blame Kurt for losing, cursing him with a streak. And so maybe, or then again, maybe it might be Kurt's first win forever. Beat the beat, beat the streak, but. I'm going for revival. All right, the cruiserweight match. I have no idea who these people are. Buddy versus Tony. I'm going for Tony to win. Don't know. I know idea about these. Ma I'm just guessing here. So this is my guess. This is a random guess match. So are these ones. Andre, Andre the Giant Battle Royal. This might, this might be Braun's time to win, but it, of course, again, he might eliminate himself chasing after the, uh, the Saturday Night Live crew, but I'm going for Braun. It might be a bad pick, but that's my pick. And finally, the Women's Battle, battle Royal. Let's go for Asuka. Probably, 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 probably too obvious. Probably, probably gonna lose, but I'm going for her, I'm going for her. All right, that's my picks for WrestleMania 35. During my review of it, I'll see how many I got right and how many I totally filled out. Never stop loading for the randomness, and see my review tomorrow tomorrow night. Bye.